everyone, and we're back. This is Miss Scarlet Tanager here with some Let's Play Dragon Age Origins. When we last left off, we got ourselves a new party member. Let's go talk to him. Hi, Severin. Here I am. Here you are. Want to answer some questions? Oh, this should be good. Go ahead. This should be good. Um, why did you want to leave the crows exactly? Well, now, I imagine that's a very fair question. Being an assassin, after all, is a, a living. You just went from killing me, go, trying to kill me, to I was simply me. never given the opportunity to choose another way. So, if that choice presents itself, why should I not seize upon it? Um... So, you're simply bored? Uh, <laughs> I don't know that I would put it precisely that way. I was but a boy of seven when I was purchased. For three sovereigns, I'm told. Which is a good which price, considering I was all ribs and Really, bone, really, and really, the um... A dagger from the pointy end. The crows buy all their assassins lot. that way. Buy them young. Raise them to know nothing else but murder. And if you do poorly in your training... You You're die. dead. <clears throat> and that system works? Of course. You compete against your fellow assassins, and those who survive are rightfully proud of it. In Antiva, being a crow gets you respect. It gets you wealth. Women. Gets you women. And men. And men. Yep. <laughs> or whatever it is you might fancy. But that Dwarves, does not mean elves. doing what is expected of you always. And it means being expendable. It's a cage, if a gilded cage. Pretty, but confining. Um... I think I understand. I mean, I am a noble, and that can be kind of confining, too. As for what I'll do in the future, presuming that there is one, I truly can't imagine. It might be interesting to go into business for myself, for a change. Far away from Antifa, Uh, business for yourself? Do you mean for now, killing people, or are you gonna open a shop? Um, won't the crows eventually find you? <laughs> Eventually can be a very, very long time if one plays one's cards right. Come now, enough chit chat. Talking about the crows summons them, you know. Any Antivan fishwife could tell you so. Really? Oh, what? What? Balls. Here I am. Oh, this should be good. Go ahead. How did I piss him off? Do you actually enjoy being an assassin? And why not? There are many things to enjoy about being a crow in Antiva. You are respected, uh, you are feared, the authorities go out of their way to overlook your trespasses, <laughs> even the rewards are nothing to turn your nose up at. Do you As get for the killing fun part, stuff? Well, some people simply need assassinating. Or do you disagree? No, yeah, yeah, like Logan probably needs some assassinating. I often find myself the instrument of fate, ending these lives for one necessity or another. I console myself with the notion that most of them had it coming. As Most of them? The act of killing itself, the ones who didn't. Why not? There is a certain artistry to the deed. The um, pleasure of sinking your blade into their flesh and knowing that their life is in your hands. Not entirely sure I agree with that. I ain't... Uh, mm. Yue doesn't en very much enjoy violence. There are many things... So she's gonna be about diplomatic. Being a crow, of course. Having no choice, being treated as an expendable commodity, the rules, oh, so many rules. Lots of rules? But simply being an assassin, I like it just fine. I will continue to do it if I can, even if I am not a crow. You're, Honestly, you're not going to kill me. something else? No, I can't really. I had some health like you. I can think of a few things. Except I'm with Alistair, so I'm not even going to try trickering a romance with him. <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> Handsome elf like you- Ah, oh, screw it. Handsome elf like you? I can think of a few things. Really? <laughs> I can picture you doing a few things yourself. Whoa! Of course, all these thoughts are moot. Chances are still good that you and I will perish, eaten by darkspawn or slain by the crows at some point. Very gruesomely, I imagine. Probably. But it is pleasant enough to chat about. Come, let's move on while our boots still have some wear in them. Yay! He proves. Hmm? Hmm? Um... Did I accidentally trigger a romance? Shit. Oh, this should be good. What would you like to discuss? I... I see. Uh, I, yep, I feel so I bad. <laughs> oh! I accidentally triggered a romance. <laughs> Shit. Oh, oh god. Can I, can I, can I fix that? Can I, is there some way I can fix that? Please tell me there's some way I can fix that. 
There is no way I can fix that. Oh, god damn it. Um, please don't hate me, Zevran. Please don't hate me. Please, please don't. Please don't hate me. Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Have, have a thing, have a thing. It. Thank you. Take the thing, take the thing. Okay. Here I am. Oh, this should be good. I didn't mean Go I didn't mean I didn't mean I didn't mean I didn't oh, mean it. You wish to know about Antiva, do you? The only way to truly appreciate it would be to go there. It is a warm place, not cold and harsh like this Ferelden. In Antiva it rains but, often, but the flowers are always in bloom. Or so the saying goes. But I like Ferelden, even though according to Stan it smells like wet dog. And it has assassins. Every land has its assassins. Some are simply more open about their business than others. I hail from the glorious Antiva city, home to the royal palace. It is a glittering gem amidst the sand, my Antiva city. Lots of sand? Do you come from some so place? So there's a desert? Um. Of course, my mother was better than any gem. <laughs> you have me there, indeed. <laughs> I, for one, can make no such claim as I never joke, laid joke, eyes joke, on joke, the woman. Joke, 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 joke. You know what is most odd? We speak of my homeland, and for all its wine and its dark-haired beauties and the lilo flutes of the minstrels, I miss the leather the most. The leather? This I have to hear! <laughs> I mean the smell. For years I lived in a tiny apartment near Antiva City's leather-making district, in a building where the crows stored their youngest recruits, packed in like crates. I grew accustomed to the stench, even though the humans complained of it constantly. To this day, the smell of fresh leather is what reminds me most of home, more than anything else. So I need to find you some Antivan leather, I take it. Um. You, smell, you smell a cesspool and think of home. <laughs> oh, not so long, I know. It is my first time away from Antiva, however. Oh. The thought of never returning makes me think of it constantly. Before I left, I was You'll go back to eventually, spend the little coin I possessed on leather boots I spotted in a store window. Finest Antivan leather. Perfect craftsmanship. Ah, but I was a fool to leave them. I thought, ah, Zevran, you can buy them when you return as a reward for a job well done. More the fool I, no? And he hasn't come back. Um, not your leather fetish. Good job, Bink. Um, your home is still there, Zevran. True, and it's You'll a go back eventually, thought. and then you One can get yourself some leather knows shoes. What is to come next? How could I have suspected I would end up defeated by a beautiful Grey Warden? Oh, God damn it! Then spares my life. Didn't we just go over this? Um. Um. Shit, what, what's not going to trigger it? What's not going to. You need to make the most of where you are. There we go. I'm just going to ignore right it. Ignore I his see comments. The grey wardens <gasps> do not recruit fools. Nope. Now, if it is all the same to you, I would prefer not to speak more of Antiva. It makes me wistful and hungry for a proper meal. Well, I can find you a good meal. Okay, good. Whew. Here I am. Whew. Oh, this should be good. Whew. Go ahead. What does it take to become an assassin? Well, the crows would have you believe that it is an involved process that takes years of training. The sort that tests both your resolve and your endurance. Survive that process and maybe, just maybe, you're good enough to start being considered one of them. But quite frankly, the truth is that all it requires is a desire to kill people for a living. It's surprising ah, how well desire we can to do kill people a for a living. Um, you did quite well, no doubt. Within the crows, I did. But it has been something the crows have devoted a great deal of time to perfecting. An assassin simply specializes in striking from stealth and in maximizing that first attack to be as lethal as possible. Debilitate your so follow, lots and lots of damage in a very, very short amount of time. Makes any follow-up combat you need to engage in that much simpler. That <laughs> sounds like it could be useful. See? Very Getting useful. For the act is please like me more, please like me An more. An assassin is more a tactical choice than a lifestyle. Of course, the crows like to pretend that their abilities are trade secrets, shrouded in shadows and wrapped in a blanket of mystery. Uh, Except so they're not at all. Let's just keep this between you and me, shall we? Hmm? We will. Yay! Yay, Zevran likes me! Here I am. Um, more questions? Oh, this should be good. Go. Okay, apparently not. Here I am. Is this something Again? personal? I'm game. No, let's not have him leave. 
happier I am. Mm, never mind. Okay. <clears throat> um, I might have to fix my mistake using some of Bowden's stuff later if I'm not able to get him to like me enough. But anyway, let's let's kit out uh, Liliana for a second for the trip to. Oh, mm, for the trip to the capital city because we have two storyline missions there, both hers and Alistair's. So we might as well make sure she's up to snuff. Let's see here. No. No. Well, I guess I have bollocks for her, so never mind. I've got a rose from Alistair. Sorry, Alistair, that I almost accidentally cheated on you. Um. Okay. Okay. How much gold do I have? No, run! Ugh, Scarlet! Okay, I have a lot. Then, I guess, let's go to Denerim. Yay? Denerim? Okay, who am I going to get rid of? When? Or Shale? Yes. Let's... Yes. I would love to take uh, Shale with me, but that's asking for trouble. So let's go to Denerim! Itchy, itchy, itchy. Wait, what? I wasn't prepared for a fight! Oh no. Oh no. Wait, what? Wait, what? Win? Oh no, is this another win cutscene? Win! Come on, win! Do it, honey. Why is your sh sword in your shoulder there? What the hell is that? Cursed creatures. Oh yay! She learned an ability! Vessel of the Spirit! Yay! Wind got more powerful! Oh, I probably should have leveled Leliana. That would be helpful. You know what? You get up! And Alistair, please heal and win. Win. I need you to heal Liliana. At your order. Your order. And... Okay, you know what? You as you wish. Start attacking him. Oh, well no wonder Attack you're ready. dead. Good to go. Okay, I can do- I, I, I can fix this! Or not. Well, shit, um... I can do this, I can- it, it just takes me a minute to get up there, guys, and don't worry about it. Hey, dude! Bonk! And then I stab you, and then you die. Eventually. This ended up being a clusterfuck now, didn't it? Win! Win help! Thank you, Win! You're amazing! In pretty much every single facility way! Kill it! Kill it! Thank you! Woo! That was close. Dark spawn! Destroy the fiends! Oh god damn it! Didn't I just Didn't I just I'm over here guys! I'm over here! Let's get started. No, 
let's get stumped. She sounds so chipper. I don't think it's going to be very easy, especially when you get your ass knocked over. Okay, and then I use this, and I stabby, stabby, stab, and I stabby, stabby, stab. Get off of my future husband. And then I go and collect the- what? <sighs> Hi, Wynn! How are you That's doing? Interesting. Yes, and slightly. Dreamy. And why are you running around like you're holding your staff out, but your staff is on your back? Did you summon the spirit? I called forth the spirit that sustains me, so that it could lend us aid. I did not realize it would take this much out of me. Uh, it seemed a good isn't that gonna kill you if you keep doing that? A little rash. I think it may have weakened the spirit a little. It took you that long to figure it out? So you could kill yourself doing this? Well, um, that's certainly conceivable. I suppose I shouldn't be using that particular trick to entertain children at parties. No! No, you shouldn't! You know yourself best, Wen. I promise I'll be careful. And thank you. Your concern is touching. She says, I promise I'll be careful, but chances are she's not going to be careful. Okay, let's level up Liliana, I guess. Liliana! You probably have a lot of leveling to do. Level, level, level. Um, have some ducks. Mm, and that. And... Bard! <coughs> yeah. Okay, now let's go see if there's anything I need to collect down here. Death root. Herlock. Just the herlock? Okay. Oh wait. Of course. Uh, you need mm, I this. Um, oh, okay, I was stuck for a second there. I was confused. What now? Who was it? Alistair. That's who it was. Oh, wrong button. Oh, wrong button. Yes. There we go. Okay, now we go onwards. I'm going to assume I need to go this way. That is a lot of dead dark spawn. Hey. Am I going this way? Am I going this way? Please tell me I'm going this way. Yes. Yes, I am. Good. World map. On to Denerim. Oh, wait. Actually, it's time for me to end this video. <laughs> My name is Miss Girl the Tanager. I'll see you all in the next video. Remember to like, favorite, and comment in the bottom of the video and everything else. See you later.